Okay. Man. Number one, I want to tell you guys, I appreciate you guys for watching my channel and for being patient with me because I am an amateur YouTuber, I'm just a regular guy. I just happen to like to make videos based upon my life experience. And in this case, weapon safety, weapons handling. So if you've been continuing along with these videos in this series particularly, uh, I keep doing push-ups between takes. Uh, as I load the video, I do some push-ups. So I'm trying to work on my fitness as a Marine. That's always ingrained in my brain. We should all think about fitness though. You only have one you. Take care of it. All right, back to this. I'm gonna start it again with where I left off. Treat never keep keep. Treat every weapon as if it were loaded. Never point at anything or anyone you don't intend to destroy or kill. Keep your finger straight off the trigger until you're ready to fire. Keep your muzzle awareness and your backstop awareness. You know where that bullet's gonna end up. As you're watching these videos, uh, refer to all of them in order so you can know what a backstop is, you know what a muzzle is. That's the muzzle, that's the business end. Notice how my finger is straight and off the trigger. I already took the magazine out. Weapon is secure and clear. I can see that there's nothing in there. Uh, I'm going to show you guys what a decocker is. This particular weapon, this pistol, is a double action pistol. It's a SIG P220, P220R, R is for rail. So it's in the cock position, which right now it's sitting on a 3.5 pound trigger pull. So it takes 3.5 pounds of pressure to fire the weapon. The, the trigger is to the rear, the hammer is to the rear. This has a hammer. Some, place, some pistols don't have a hammer, some are striker fired. So this one has a decock lever, which is right here, decocks the gun. Now it has a 10 pound pressure. To fire the gun, it would take 10 pounds of pressure to pull that to make it discharge. So that's the difference. Double action, single action, decock. Okay, even when I'm messing around and I'm carrying it you know, around, around my house, I still treat it as if, as if it's loaded and I'm aware of where that muzzle is. If you notice, that muzzle does not point at me. I never will allow that, that muzzle, tip of that opening, to point at me. I'm not gonna sweep any, there's nobody here, but I wouldn't sweep it across like the lady did in the video, the, the couple. So to, to wrap this up, the whole point of this is if you're not aware of some basic fundamentals of marksmanship and of weapons handling, we already went over them. Treat, never, keep, keep. Treat every weapon as if it were loaded at all times. Never point a weapon at anything or anyone until or unless you're ready to shoot it. Keep your finger straight, not like that straight, and off the trigger until you're ready to fire. Keep, the, keep your muzzle awareness, meaning you know, where it, you know where it's at at all times, and backstop awareness. You know what's going to stop that bullet. You know where that bullet's going to wind up. Okay, so let's see. Let's go over a few things. So if you look in the back of this pistol, I'm going to point it at this thing for... If you look at the back of that pistol, it's hard to line it up, but you see those two dots? Well, there's another dot up there. See it? Those dots line up. And when they line up, 